time experience in El Fantasmo, don't worry, be part of the little revolution that's happening currently in the UK because like so many foreigners he's coming over here and enjoying the benefits of being not necessarily uh, mishandled by his uh, own country but realising the UK scene is currently hotter than steak and kidney pie and it's been so, well, hell, this is the crowd, first time here at North Reston, you already know the chance. He has swapped poutine for Savaloy dip. Christ. And, and let's just take a moment to drink in the North Faithful's reaction to this. El Fantasmo is about to take on Robbie X. I'd like to welcome Dave Meltzer, who has just suddenly felt the urge to put this video on at this particular point. Some sort of spider sense, like twitch in the back of your head. Whop, whop out a couple of stars, maybe five. Well, I see two big stars in this match. Robbie X. It's the only time that one plus one is about to make five. Wow, that was beautiful. Write that one down. And uh, Robbie X obviously drawn lots of success on World of Sport. Oh, yes, indeed. A massive part of ITV1's uh, wrestling program for the last 10 weeks. So exciting to see Robbie X on such a huge platform. Mm. That, so we can brag and say that we had Robbie X. We, can we, we, we gave him on loan the sport and he's speaking of loan of a Tasmo currently with talent on loan from God he's talking a world of sport gymnastics currently between oh. that was a good effort Robbie X Robbie X won't mind me saying that when you when you look at Robbie X you don't see somebody who is going to potentially light the ring up but I Absolutely. promise you that is your first mistake when it comes to Robbie X whoa what, what, what is happening here Fantasmo with a lion salt and the Tony Hawks. Well. So these two are assembling five-star matches just on their own. This is how Ridgeway and Drake felt each other out with the Matt Grappling. These two very agile flip-floppers showing each other. I'm not intimidated. Anything you can do, I can do better. We have the City Games in Newcastle just the other week. I think these two are key candidates for next year if they wanted to get involved. Well, we haven't even locked up yet and we've seen all these moves so far. El Fantasmo and Robbie X playing Can You Top This? Cruiserweight edition. And like you say, Matthew, we've not even locked up yet. Oh, I'm hyped. I, I, what, what I, are you on the show? Jesus. It's like I booked this. I'm so happy. Matthew Gregg and his copy of Extreme Warfare Revenge could not have pulled together a card <laughs> quite like NCL 12. Nobody pray for me. Jesus. What oh, is this? No, don't no. ruin it. John Myers. Springboard John Myers. Oh, what a maneuver. <laughs> you still got it. <laughs> yeah, Bobby X is gone. Fantasmo has gone. He's got it. It being Ricketts. Well, it's already six stars, and uh, is the bell rang? Oh. Corner is not even dead, but he's spinning in his grave. Well, but Corner, Sodger, this is going to be ace. Well, we've right. got the frivolities out of the way. And now the match begins. Robbie X and El Fantasmo, North Wrestling. Rolling out. It's on that wrist lock. Round and round we go. El Fantasmo got the highest advantage. Robbie X, no doubt, has the... No, Robbie X has wrestled in the Riverside so many times now. He knows the he knows the pace, he knows the feel. That has to play some kind of role in this match. This is home turf for Robbie X, and he's from the south. Oh, up, down, up, down, left, right. Uh, those are codes. Robbie X isn't sweating El Fantasmo or his reputation. He has trunks older than NFL Tasmo. This is a moment. Lincoln's greatest wrestling export versus the high flyer from British Columbia. Only here at North Wrestling. Only here at the Riverside. Round and round oh, we go. Springboard. Dark wheel. Down. Frankensteiner. Dark wheel. Ducks. 
Looks like Moonsault comes to the steep. Hit the midsection. Oh. Sensational! Oh. Trying to put off the pose. Skip up. Skip up. Robbie X and El Fantasmo are stalemate. Really, the, what have you got? Match. Both men and going, they have better cardio, better agility, better flipping. And the Spandau Ballet goes on. Like this. Oh, perfect. perfect. The very top of the forehead of Robbie X. Absolutely done so to remind him that he is a uh, small stature than his opponent. Yeah, Robbie X very much does not have the height advantage, but you know what? There's the speed, there's the experience factor. That is going to come into play. El Fantasmo now. Oh, very risky move. Very easily countered, but no. Wrist lock sinked in. He's gone round one set of ropes. He's gone down two set of ropes. Is he gonna He's be on third base. Can he make it? Home run. They have baseball in Canada. I've just been told they do. And all the way... And he's going again. Hey, look, if you're going to... Look, people, some people only visit Newcastle once in their life. You might as well oh, talk. Oh, here he goes. He blows it. Gets back on the horse. Does it again. Three times. And a... Frankensteiner. Pitcher. Perfect Frankensteiner. The cockiest goddamn extended wrist lock. Walk the ropes, Frankensteiner. You'll ever see. And one of the first proper moves of the match from El Fantasmo. Fantasmo now out of the ring. No springboarding. If you are needing some self-confidence, uh, Alfred Tasma has some to spare. I'm needing some salts at the moment. Feel faint watching this. Probably excellent impressed. Big kick to Alfred Tasma's face. And huge shot by Robbie X. That stout, hard chop to the chest of El Fantasmo. I think if Robbie X wanted to go to that playbook, if he wanted to find an answer for El Fantasmo, he's got to be looking to play a strength card. He's got that core strength over El Fantasmo. Absolutely. Uh, Robbie X, the human kettle weight, used the strike to his advantage. He has a proper advantage. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, it's out of the way. Not in the basement drop kick sequence. Robbie X loves that setup. Very effective there. Yeah, this very, very feels this stage, but they're pinned wearing out some of the most amazing cardio. So what we're saying, this feels like a match a lifetime in the making. We couldn't put this match on any time before now because had oh, this match well gone said. on YouTube, can you imagine watching this match on YouTube with all that buffering back in 2005? No chance, Sundance. Robbie X was 15. Absolutely not. It would I would still been sensational at 15. Alpha Dotter would still been the ECCW champion. Sammy had the title, he had it for 560 days. Incredible achievement by uh, El Fantasmo. And if you, El Fantasmo, in his own right, a Canadian five-star match machine. Look up when you're not watching northwesting.pivotshed.com. Do take time to look up El Fantasmo versus Kyle O'Reilly for the, for, the, for the Canadian Championship, the ECCW Championship. Oh, sensational affair, but I'd argue... That's it. You Spring might look weak compared to this. Cross body. Oh, gets himself off the pin, so he can nail. Lion Salt, you'll be executed. Just a two count. It's another stopping moves, hit other moves. Up to the level of uh, forward thinking we're getting from both these individuals. Robbie X, almost a year into his North wrestling career. He's become North's very own great match machine. Some memorable collisions with Amir Jordan and HT Drake so far. Absolutely, and people do remember the quality of the matches, however, Wins and losses are important here at North. So if you can get one from El Fantasmo in his debut, that'd be amazing for Robbie X. And El Fantasmo, uh, revving up the band, I don't know how smart this is. Robbie X just buying his time. Oh, I mean, clearly, I mean, come on. <laughs> oh, what? Good night! And here comes Robbie X! Quicker than the proverbial hiccup. Here comes Robbie X. Bring shooting star press. Exclamation oh. by Robbie X. You see that he did the dive from the ring to the outside and held him up so he could throw him in. Robbie X very focused on getting the match won today. Robbie X good. has executed two minutes worth of moves in three seconds. It's good to see him more 
focus on winning the match than El Fantasma, who I love, but cannot be taught in front of the crew. probably X in three minutes. Express. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, uh oh. Not the, not the old uh, Nick Mondo. Ah, oh, shades of classic wrestling, world of sports it style. The driver. Two. Simple but effective, but not quite three count worthy from El Fantasmo. My goodness, Robbie X and El Fantasmo, everything that it was hyped up to be when we announced El Fantasmo would go one on one with Robbie X. It became the most anticipated match in the history of North Wrestling. And now you're seeing why. Irish whip. Robbie X on the ropes. And a big shot in the face. That strong base, that strong call from Robbie X stopping the process. Oh, pulling leave. Holding on. Turning this in to Cradle Package Power Bomb. Oh, can he execute it though on the large physique of El Fantasmo? Yes, he can, ladies and gentlemen. Spinning round and round into a package brainbuster two count only. I'm sweating a lot watching this. Robbie X and El Fantasmo going back and forth and putting on an absolute clinic for the North Faithful. You could gift this entire match. Robbie, Robbie X on the top rope where he feels home. You've also done Newcastle one time. Here. Huge oh, moonsault oh, counter. So I'm moving though. Great reactions. Sunset flip into a Canadian destroyer. Oh wait! Have a receipt! And another one! Robbie X's oh. momentum bounced him into his own Canadian destroyer! He slowed up, used the last bit of remaining energy he had to plant Elva Dosmo with his very own Canadian destroyer. And now both men down, neither one can come up, guys. He's for me to say, all those beautiful destroyers we just saw. I literally have no idea what's going to happen next. What either man's going to bust out in this contest. El Fantasmo wants to get the win here for people who don't know who he is. So he continue his, his very slow progression across the entire UK and Ireland. And Robbie X will remind people is more He's a mass wrestler on World of Sport. Robbie X, no mask tonight. He is open and leaving it all in the ring against El Fantasmo. No mask. Which of these men was the first to say, no mask, no mask. Low kick to the legs. That will take off his aerial abilities. And that will take his teeth out with a shot to the mouth. And this will lead to the Express. Here we go! Oh! Super kick to the beard. Oh. You can see how much the fans are into it. You can hear someone very loud and kick out. He couldn't have nailed it any more perfectly than he did. But it still oh, no. was not enough. This is where El Cosmo loves to be. Best moonsault ever. Not quite. Robbie be excellent top rope again. Will he go for that flip? Misses that. El Fantasmo in the corner. Super kick. Take a shot. What the fuck? Moonsault kick to the face of El Fantasmo. And again, both men exhausting their energy supplies, and neither men can capitalize. It's all about mashing a pad now from both competitors. Robbie X and El Fantasmo have given each other everything. Endless, effortless stream of kicks, punches, spins, and neither man has yet gained a three. Both been very popular with the fans here. New fans, old fans, doesn't matter. And now going shot for shot, slap for slap. Big, big, big right hand from Robbie X and El Fantasma with a receipt. Oh, a glancing blow there, enough to, oh, no it isn't. Bicycle kick by El Fantasmo. Super kick by El Fantasmo. The midsection sets up. Nothing. Counted. And it was sit out DVD. Rolling him up. He's not finished him yet. And X marks the spot. The Express perfectly executed. And that'll do it. Two of 
of the wrestling world's finest flyers collide in mid-air over the River Tyne and it was Robbie X that took the win at NCL 12.